what is up? It is your boy Pete Times Creed Nethercoat here with some more Sonic fan gaming. We are doing, as you have no doubt told by the title, Sonic 3D in 2D. I believe this was made by Sotanuk. Uh, this came out a few years ago. Uh, I did attempt it back on release, but I never really got far of it, and it's been like four years. Since we've really attempted it. And I, it's always been something I wanted to go back to. Because as you've known from a previous playthrough. Sonic 3D. One of my favourite Sonic games. So. We're going to take a crack at this. Uh, I do not remember nearly anything. So. We are, we have Sonic. We've got Tails. We've got Nux. Uh, there's extra stuff. There's nothing to do. So. Let's go. I guess. So. Oh, it's a familiar cutscene. With some extra drawn stuff. <laughs> I do love it. I do I do have a soft spot for like old robotnik kind of looking ass, you know? Ba 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 Right, so Let's uh, do it. So, I do not know uh, how... Because I know that there are obviously emeralds in this. Um, I cannot for the life of me... Well, I guess that answers that question then, doesn't it? But how do we get in there? That's the real question. Boing. I'm a... Uh, God damn. I, I am kind of digging like some of the um, the the bad Nick designs to be completely honest with you. Right, so we can't go left and get in there. So can we go right and get in there? Ooh, a homing shield. I feel like I can. Ugh. Oh gee, I wonder what's up here. Uh... If that was because I was like three rings short, I will not be happy, basically. No, my rings. My precious rings. I I'm just exploring at this point. And probably for good reason too, I guess. Uh-oh. I mean, at this point, I don't even have anywhere remotely close to 50 rings to be able to get into any sort of special stage if there is a big ring. So, that is going to be something we're going to try to do. Again, three rings, three things, three rings, not enough. <laughs> I don't know. Because obviously Tails and Knuckles they've made as part of the the playable game loop. So I have no idea if I can find them in the wild or... God damn. Gee, I wonder if I go down. So yeah, I'm, I'm definitely interested to see what the, the special stage... Oh, that just slowed me down. Okay. That's well, a familiar looking... Oh, I already had... I already had all the emeralds. That's why we couldn't enter a special stage. Yeah, alright. They've uh, definitely souped up this version of Silver Sonic, haven't they? Okay. Got a little bit lucky there, I guess. Uh, gonna have to do this ringless, I guess. Man, I keep jumping too early. 
But I'm glad I made the decision to go ringless. Well, okay, I got one emerald. <laughs> sure. That was definitely a lot rougher than I thought it would be. <laughs> All right. All right. Act two it is then. I'm kind of bummed that there's no... Like, I'm kind of... I'm so used to just playing... Um, God damn it. I'm so used to just playing uh, 3D at my own leisure that I'm just used to just exploration of the level and generally knowing where everything is. So, while it is nice to have that little bit of... Uh, well, not, not knowledge isn't the, the word I'm looking for. God damn it. Uh, knowledge isn't the word I'm looking for, but um, I'm just going to, I'm just going to get my ass beaten here. Um, okay. Was not expecting that. Sure. Oh my fuck. I'm already starting to get a little bit annoyed about the bad Nick placement. Like that's one of the best. That's one of the better things about um, 3D is that you don't have to worry about bad Nick placement because you know you're just playing it. You know where they are, or you if you don't know where they are, you're going to be finding out where they are because that's what you need to do. Whereas this is just. Bad nicks everywhere. So I wonder if we'll have the... Uh, what's it called? The actual... Uh, Green Grove's boss, if they've managed to translate that into the game. That'd be cool. Ooh. Because so far, this is... It's valiant, but I mean, so far, the only thing that this is reminding me of is, is it's a... Okay. Oh, well, I'm guessing yes. All right. I just jumped into it myself. I need that ring, please. Now, there should normally be a safe spot. Uh, excuse me. Just because of the way the physics and these damn things work. Well, goddamn. I hit the edge rather than the top. Wow, they've really thought about this, boss, didn't they? Working on a 2D plane. That's uh, interesting. Let's just grab some rings quick. God damn it. Alright. I don't think this corner is going to be safe this time. Oh, it is for a little bit. Not that time. I think we're, we're going to be dying ahead again here, folks. But it still remains one of the better all-time boss themes. I do dig this boss theme. And I think it is... By far better than quite a lot of boss themes that they've done. Vocal themes not included, you know. I don't know. There's just something about it that's just pretty damn cool. God damn it. ba 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 da 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 Sure. At least I'm not chasing a, a, a ring this time. Uh, I should be safe here, I think. No, I was wrong. I have barely hit this guy. <laughs> Christ on a bike. I'm being really bad at the first boss.
I just can't get the mechanic down. Like, at least in the actual 3D version, you could literally just dodge it, you know? Like, you could just run around in a... In a in a circle and just not give God damn it. You could just run around in a circle and just it not chase you, but because this is um because this is designed in a really tight box, there's not really a lot you can do to just deal with it. Or rather, there probably is a way you can deal with it, but I'm just not dealing with it in a in the proper way. God damn it. Even the ceiling for that was rough. You mother. Oh, do you know what? That was a very skillful jump. I'll take it. That, however, was not very good at all. And now I'm out of rings again. It has been a very long time since I have game overed on the first boss. Like, of anything. Oh, fuck. I'm doing really poorly, even for me. Do you know what? If I can just scrape through this with one ring, I'll take it. God damn it. Oh, come on. Jesus, thank God. <laughs> oh my God, I got through that so badly. Holy. Ooh, well that was an interesting thing. Right, that was the end of Green Groves. That has been, that was super rough. Uh, so I guess I will see you next time for Rusty Ruin. Still no idea how to get the emeralds, and we'll have to see how that goes. But, you know, it's a fun little romp so far. I'd like to see what the special stages bring me, so hopefully we'll stumble upon one. Until then, ladies and gentlemen, as always, I have been Pete Titans Creed Nethercoat from Project Phoenix Productions, and as always, I ask you to stay safe, take care, and play more games. <laughs> <laughs>